This video provides instructions for the 3M Bear Hugger Temperature Monitoring System and is intended for clinicians. Prior to use of the 3M Bear Hugger Temperature Monitoring System, consult detailed product instructions and important prescribing information contained in the instructions for use and operator's manual. Additional safety information specific to the product is available at the end of the video. To begin, mount the control unit. There are several options. A knob on the back of the control unit allows you to adjust the height and orientation as well as for securement to an IV pole. Another option is to work with the biomed technicians at your facilities to mount the control unit to the patient monitor or other desired location in the care setting. Connect the power supply to the back of the control unit. Plug the power supply into an appropriate outlet. If desired, a monitor cable is available to connect the bear hugger temperature monitoring control unit and the patient monitor. This may have already been done by the biomed technician during installation. If utilizing this feature, ensure the cable is connected to the back of the control unit and to the temperature input on the patient monitor. You will see the control unit screen illuminate to the standby screen. Connect the sensor cable to the front of the control unit. First, use an alcohol wipe to clean and disinfect the patient's forehead above the orbital ridge. Allow the patient's forehead to completely dry. Connect the sensor to the sensor cable connector and ensure the sensor tab is fully inserted. The display on the control unit will change to the ready screen once it confirms the sensor connection. Remove the backing liner from the sensor to expose the adhesive. Do not bend the sensor when removing the backing liner. Position the sensor cable away from the patient's face and apply the sensor to the patient's forehead above the orbital ridge on either side, avoiding the frontal sinuses. Do not reposition the sensor. Gently press the edge of the sensor to ensure good adhesion with the skin. If desired, support the temperature sensor cable with the sensor cable clip. The control unit will sense patient attachment after several seconds and the unit will display the change to the equilibration screen. The flashing yellow temperature display and a graph below the temperature will indicate the progress of equilibration. The control unit can display temperature measurements in either Celsius or Fahrenheit. Push the temperature display button on the back of the control unit to change the temperature display. The unit is factory preset to Celsius. The patient's temperature will display on the monitor in bold white numbers when equilibration is complete. Once equilibration is complete, the temperature will also display on the connected patient monitor if applicable. When the patient is ready to be moved from the location, for example from pre-op to the OR, or from the patient unit to another destination, Disconnect the sensor from the sensor cable and then disconnect the cord clip. The sensor should be left on the patient and reconnected to another bear hugger temperature monitoring control unit. When the patient has been transferred, start by carefully reconnecting the sensor to the sensor cable and control unit and attach the cord clip if desired. When the sensor is reconnected, the system will re-equilibrate. The patient's last recorded temperature will be captured in the upper left-hand corner of the screen. The sensor can save up to two hours of temperatures. A trend graph will appear at the bottom of the screen with the patient's last two hours of temperatures displayed in five-minute increments, filling up from the right. The blue bars indicate that the temp dropped below 36 degrees Celsius. White indicate the temperature is above 36 degrees Celsius. When temperature monitoring is no longer needed, or if the sensor has been in place for 24 hours, simply disconnect the sensor from the sensor cable and then disconnect the cord clip. To remove the sensor, start at the edge of the sensor and gently peel it away from the patient. If needed, use an alcohol or cotton swab along the edge of the sensor to help remove the sensor from the patient. Clean the control unit on an as-needed basis or per facility policies and procedures for cleaning electronic equipment. Clean the sensor cable between each use. Use a damp soft cloth and a hospital-approved mild detergent, germicidal disposable wipes, disinfecting towelette or antimicrobial spray. Refer to the operator's manual for more information.
As with any device, it is important to read and understand the detailed instructions for use and safety information. This device is restricted to sale by or on order of a licensed healthcare professional. If you have any product questions, please contact your local 3M representative. 3M offers device training upon request.